AK Droner. Brutus. Way smoother than that. Rudy, come here. Well, that makes, gives me a goal. I need to lose more weight with it now. Okay. I really like the way it handles with it now. Well, good. It's more... So watch if this is floored going up. That's floored. Jeez, slow. Yeah. Fly better? Well, yeah, without the... So um, it's fairly windy. It's more wind than I normally fly in. You know. Yeah. So. Cool, man. Sadie, come here. Come here. There's a strong wind out there. Mm -hmm. yeah. There's a plane. Yeah. Have birds in there. That's good. Less affected by the wind, it really is. But it does not handle the weight of a gimbal. 
as well. See, look at that, how the wind pushes it? Yeah. But it does handle well. I mean, it's very stable. More stable than the two prop, but not with the, the heavy gimbal on. Cool, baby. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, yeah, I don't normally fly in this kind of heavy wind. Uh -uh. Get back over here and try. That's Florida. That's all she's got. That <laughs> bird coming after me. So my general thoughts of the doll prop 6045 uh, tri-prop is basically this. The um, Bugs 3 actually handles way better, uh, turns sharper. Um, when it's not got a action camera and gimbal loaded, it actually climbs faster in my opinion. Um, with the gimbal or without the gimbal, it definitely uh, is more stable, handles wind much better. Um, overall, I'd say it's a more sporty, uh, agile, stable, uh, fun quad to fly with the doll prop 6045 uh, triprops. Uh, where I would say the only downfall I can find uh, compared to the MGX uh, Bugs 3 uh, two blade props that it comes with is when it's loaded down the two props from the factory absolutely will hold and climb uh, better with more weight uh, underneath the, the bugs. Uh, that can be a drawback as well because just because it climbs better doesn't mean it's more stable and better for filming. Uh, it's also noisier and you get more distortion. But it definitely handles weight better with the stock props. Um, I'm thinking about, these are six inch tri props, these doll props. I'm almost thinking about trying a, a seven inch or eight inch, um, or you know, something different to just get a comparison. But uh, overall, I mean, I hope this video shows you the difference in stability. It's actually quieter, it's more sporty. And uh, overall, I would definitely say it's a great mod, though if you're doing it for filming uh, and you're running a little bit of a heavy load like I am with the uh, uh, Walkera 2D gimbal, uh, you're going to struggle a little bit in recovery. And this last video shows where I almost uh, come down, uh, I thought under control, and then notice when I powered up, it wasn't slowing down. I had to slam her forward to save it from hitting the ground. So for everything other than uh, running my gimbal, uh, setup that I currently use, I would say this is a, a good mod. Um, I'll try some more and get back with you. Hope this helps.